Well, we are going to see a lot of cloud cover out there for your Friday. Any sunshine this morning going to be pretty limited before the clouds fill back in. We'll look for temperatures in the lower 30s as we go through uh, much of the early afternoon hours. We're dry through at least the early afternoon. And then as we head towards about 4, 5 o'clock and beyond, we'll see some snow starting to move in. Uh, best chance to see that snow is going to be further south. where That's where the snow is going to be steadiest uh, as we go through those evening hours. Further north towards Cleveland, the Lake Erie shoreline, less likely to see that snow through the latter part of the day. Where that snow does move in, we'll see some low visibility, and that could mean some slowdowns for that evening commute, so keep that in mind. We'll keep that snow focused on those southern areas through the evening hours. We might get a couple of brief snow showers up towards the Lake Erie shoreline, but the majority of that staying mainly south of, say, the Turnpike or so. So we will see that moving out as we go through the evening and overnight. We'll taper off to more lake effect snow potential heading into Saturday. Uh, for most of us, especially south of the Turnpike, we could see about one to two inches of snow with this up areas up towards uh, the lakeshore. That'll be less, but we will see the chance for that lake effect to kick in as we get into a Saturday. Saturday is going to be a cold day for us. Temperatures only topping out in the 20s. It's going to feel more like the teens for much of the day. We're looking drier and better for the rest of that long weekend. Close to 40 again on a Sunday. A President's Day is looking nice and bright with some sunshine returning and then temperatures continue to improve. We're into the low 50s by Tuesday and Wednesday. We should hold off until late Wednesday into Thursday for another chance for some rain.